My word of the year this year is epic. And that's precisely the word from which I decided to craft my birthday celebration. Last year, I turned 30 and I was actually basically in the hospital suffering majorly and couldn't even celebrate my birthday almost at all. So this year, I really wanted to do something special and I decided to go with two of my best friends and I to an all-day water adventure. We booked a day of parasailing, jet skis, and snorkeling. And unfortunately, back in January, it was way too windy here in the Florida Keys for us to enjoy the full experience. We only really got to go parasailing. And by the way, my friend Lisa was scared to go up on the parasails, so I was holding her hand, which is so cute. They dipped our toes in the water. It was really fun. Then I went up with my other bestie, Carissa, and I'm really glad I brought my phone. It's just amazing to have these memories to look back on. When we got back to the main boat after that, uh, we went on this trampoline and we tried to go on jet skis. We went on like a banana boat, but we literally got waterboarded. It was just so choppy and so rough. Yeah. Like we were barely got through that. <laughs> and also this is why you'll see me later uh, fall off a ladder. It's because it was so windy and the water was so wavy, okay? It's not because I'm not strong. <laughs> After having a little bit of fun on the water, we got back to the main oh boat and took some videos and just had a little bit of a fun time oh before gosh. heading back to the mainland in Key West. Oh, you can actually see the banana boat to the right of the video there. <laughs> After coming back to the mainland, we walked around Key West and we went to a coffee shop, which was so good, you guys. Um, one thing that really set it apart for me, because a lot of places have, you know, pretty good food and pretty cute decorations. But the thing that really set it apart for me was uh, the fact that the iced coffee had coffee ice cubes, which meant that as the ice cubes melted my drink did not get watered down so i'm really impressed by that so props to coffee house uh, after that we continued walking around and we went to a rum distillery where carissa and i got a little drinky drink and that was really yummy too and to finish the day off at the end of the day we went to a place called my new joint which is along the overseas highway uh, right above square grouper which is kind of a legendary restaurant as well my new joint is a weed themed restaurant although they do not have any thc in any of the food or uh, as an ingredient they just use fun punny names for all the menu items and it was pretty delicious and i'm glad we tried it out so now i'm just thinking how do i celebrate next year even better how do i make it even more epic more rewarding and more luxurious and just more authentic to who i actually am